Hello everyone, my name is the Jurassic Insider and welcome back to Jurassic World the game. Have we won it? Yeah, there we go. I mean, I say have we won it all the time, but at this point, I usually check into the tournament right before. Um, so I generally know that we made it, but just in case I didn't want to jinx ourselves and it leads to a cool build-up. But there we go, our Lithosaurus pack. Um, no bucks. Hmm, disappointing. Because I did spend some bucks, but the Earl of Asaurus looked freaking awesome. Way cooler than the Tyrannolophosaur or whatever. Like, that's just, that's just a Dilophosaurus, man. I don't know what else to tell you. It's a, it's a, it's a little bit furrier. It's a, it's a little bit spikier, but it's cool looking. I love that thing so much. The stats are on the lower end because it is one of the earliest hybrids in the game. And I believe one of the cheapest. Yeah, it looks like it's the cheapest out of these guys. Probably stronger than Glithornax, if I'm not. Yeah, easily stronger than Glithornax. So it's not even that bad. It's quite good, actually. It's just, right now, it doesn't really matter how cheap they are because I'm not going to be buying anymore. But in the long run, it's good that some of them are on the cheaper end. And I think Earl of Source is the cheapest one. Maybe, I know Gorgon Sutures is like 39000 so I think it's around there. Gorgon Sutures is a bargain hybrid, uh, for sure. But anyways, I just started yapping out of nowhere. I uh, didn't even really catch my breath. Uh, yeah, we're on 27000 bucks exactly, which is amazing. Would have been better if it was 27500 but uh, apparently not. And uh, food is max, so I don't want to collect any food at all. Coin is not, though, so I will collect some coin. But anyways, uh, here for just a quick episode. Um, nothing too much because my school has started. And uh, my headphone just fell on my ear. Um... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, sorry, I'm just very frantic because I knew I wanted to do an episode today because I had to join the game to get the Earl of Azores thing and I just wanted to record an episode for you guys because it's fun. Um, but also, I just don't have that much time. But uh, yeah, we can see what we can get done today, see if we can do much at all or at least just something here and there. Um, it'll be fun. Yeah, fun. <laughs> oh, boy, boy. Okay, okay. Um, just a few more things there. And I think that's it. Okay. Oh, I know what we're doing today. I know exactly what we can do today. I think I have enough time for it. I'm not really in a time crunch. I just I kind of want to go to bed and I'm kind of tired. Um, but, but we have got an awesome hybrid today. I was just talking about him, Gorgas Suchus. I think, if I'm not mistaken, Gorgas Suchus should be done in the incubation. So we'll get out Gorgas Suchus today, and he'll be a shiny new amphibian. We've been doing good on amphibians recently with the um whatever this is, Dipl Diplosuchus, which was a huge help during the tournament. I think the tournament would have been even worse if it weren't for them, and I actually had to level up a few of them to level 10. And I did post that community post on, uh, my, well, my community post stuff. And uh, if you answered it, thank you very much. It was basically saying, if you haven't seen it yet, it's like, uh, how many, or wh what Dipl how many Diplosuchuses should I fuse, if any at all? In the general consensus was like one or two, and then some people that, I don't want to say are more experienced, because of course I don't know who's more experienced and whatnot, I don't know everybody's park levels and everything, and I'm okay with taking anybody's advice, because you know, regardless of park level, it doesn't matter, like, I'm not maxed out, I've never been maxed out on any account, but I would say I generally know a lot about this game. But, um, it seems that uh, a lot of people that especially on the discord they're telling me that i should keep eight level four le sorry not le that would be amazing i should keep eight level tens so i think that's what i'm gonna do because i either, either way i'm only gonna gain like 500 health and like 200 attack which really isn't that much um so i think i'd rather save it you know maybe if i get a couple more diplosutrices maybe once the paddock is full um, then I can start fusing them, but otherwise I think I'm good, honestly. I think it's overall just a lot better of an idea right now to save. So that's what we're gonna be doing, I think. That's what we're gonna do. So for now, either way, even if we change our mind in the future, we can go in and level up these Diplosuchuses. And you know what? Eight already on- oh, no, no, that's what the opposite of what we're trying to do here. Um, eight Diplosuchuses will be fantastic either way, so I think we'll- we'll take it as a win. And hopefully the coin production is going up. It's actually not. Nipple Suit just has a surprisingly low coin production, 210,000 every three hours with like a, what, 352% bonus? Yeah, nowhere near as good as Dipple Suit just, which I think was the same time, but like nearly half a million coins, so like nearly double or even triple that amount. So not the best. Um, Spider Raptor is actually even better. Um, and Corner Raptor is right now the main coin MVP. One day we'll get Diplotator back. Or maybe once we start fusing the Diplosuchuses, that'll get better. But for right now, it seems like Alangosaurus, 
Carnoraptor. Actually, Carnoraptor is not even really in the question. It really just is a Langosaurus and Labyrinthosaurus because we have a level 40 and a level 30 of each. I guess a level one. <laughs> a couple level ones were a Langosaurus there. Um, anyways, goodness gracious. If it sounds like I'm out of breath, I am out of breath. My God. Um, <laughs> let me rest things. Um, how you guys doing though? How's your day? I hope you're having a Jurassic day. I don't, I don't know what that means. I've been saying that for the longest time. I don't know what it means to have a Jurassic Day. I, I hope it's your day's just full of dinosaurs. Because that's awesome. Because we all love dinosaurs. You wouldn't be watching me if you didn't like dinosaurs. I don't know. Apparently, a lot of people who play this game don't really care about Jurassic World or Jurassic Park at all. Um, but I do. This channel was actually not meant for me to play Jurassic World the game on. I never thought of doing that. I was just was like, I was going to post a bunch of Jurassic Park videos, whatever that meant. Like reviews and rankings. Like, very generic stuff, and there is a Diplosuchus, uh, not a Diplosuchus, what the hell is it called? Gorgosuchus, there we go, I'm excited for this bad boy. Um, and we'll see, we will see. I mean, a couple months ago, I would have been fine with maxing out Gorgosuchus to get, um, because our Capasuchus would be easy. I would be fine with getting Gorgosuchus, because I was always known, always known, it was a bargain hybrid again. So I can't speak, but now there's a lot less of a reason to, because I can just buy them. Um, I mean, I can also get one for free if I do that, but whatever. Um, so, I think we're good. Let's get it. Let's get it, the Gorgas Suchus. We just got Chromos Finus recently, I think. Uh, Ow, we've had a lot of these guys for a while. I think Gorgas Suchus was our fourth tournament. Um, so we have Chromos Finus, Terraquatzal, and then we haven't done Dracoceratops, and then it was Gorgas Suchus, which we're getting now. So next will probably be Dracoceratops, but I'm excited to see Gorgas Suchus. We'll focus on all those other guys later when we need to. Let's check out this guy for now. We'll put him right beside back at Galosaurus. I think that makes enough sense. <gasps> He's so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I mean, the face is ugly, but it's beautiful. You know what I mean? It's so cool. My goodness. It's always already so strong. Oh, yes. All right. Let's see this. Let's get you fed up. I'll keep one left. One little feed left. And let's see it. Ooh. Still just a regular crocodilian animation. Just like Caprasuchus. Did Caprasuchus have that? I believe so. I believe it did. Yes, yes, of, of course, because it has a four legs. I know there's one creature that has, um, Ostoposaurus. That's Ostoposaurus. I, I never know which one is. I call it, I say Ostoposaurus, so Ostoposaurus makes more sense. Um, but that creature uses Microposaurus, which is the regular amphibian, like the four leg, close to the ground amphibian, not the crocodilian type. And he uses the crocodilian animation. So I think that's the only creature that uses a different animation. Than whatever it's made out of. I don't know. I'm just nerding out. Um, but let's get one more. Feed it one more time. Ooh, a solid 2,500 health. He is a nice health tank. I, I, I remember him being more of a health tank. I think he has nine. Yeah, we just checked. 9,000 health, 2,500 attack. Which sounds like very much health. But it's not that much. It, it can still kill itself in three hits. So I wouldn't say it's a health tank. I'd say it's balanced. But not nearly as balanced, you know, as some other creatures. Like... Typically, it would be like in the 6,000 to 2,000 ratio range, if, if that makes any sense at all, or if I'm just blabbing on, uh, blabbering on. Um, anyways, let's check. Am I zoomed out? Uh, there, maybe my phone's just making everything smaller. So there we go. We got all these turning hybrids out here. Domus Rex isn't one, but you can basically say it is at this point. Um, so let's check it out. Where do we want to check it out? We can check it out at... Um, I guess we could check out here, yeah. I um, really want to do this event, by the way, but I don't think I will because I need a ghost. It's such a good event, and it, it doesn't even look that hard. It looks so easy, but we don't have a ghost. Oh, my God. I think there's another one with Panthera or something down the line. Um, I can do that one, but I'm so mad because that's like a tournament creature right here. I mean, other than it costing 4.5 million coins, it's really like it seems like a steal to me. No bucks, of course, but 2,500 DNA is not bad either. And there we go, there is Gorgeous Suit just right above Terra Quetzal, even though it's definitely cheaper. So, nice to know there, nice to know. Again, those early hybrids are going to be a huge bargain. They're still some of the best. Like, there's no doubt that Metrophodon is, is the best of the flyers. Gorgeous Suit just is probably tied with Bagasaurus. I've heard a lot of great things about Bagasaurus just because it is that huge health tank. And I think it's, it depends on how much health it has. I don't actually know how much it has. I, it's, I did like, I think it's 6,000. If it's 6,000 and 3,000 attack or 4,000 attack, then it's better. But if it's like closer to like 4,000 health, 
I, I don't know. I, I claim to have a lot of this memorized, or not memorized, but have a good estimate, but I, I really don't know. I, especially with the newer hybrids. Um, old hybrids though, I know. I know Cygnus here just has like 4,777 health. Is that like exactly right? I, I don't think so, but maybe it is. That would be cool. Um, <laughs> anyways, uh, again, just continuing to yap. Yapping all over the place. Okay, let's see. So yeah, look at all those nipple sutures. They don't even fit in one row. I gotta scroll to see them all. That's beautiful. Beautiful. They're all really good. Like this lineup up here, up until the last Diplo Sutures, is like the really strong ones. At some point here, this was like our really strong ones. But now it's sort of shifted to this, which is really cool. Um, we got the big boys, which are the first five, which can only be used like every now and then, you know. I used Indominus Rex this morning. He's still cooling down. Um, same thing with Terraquat Sal. Then there's like this range, which I'd say Mastodonosaurus through Diplosuchus. Like those are all, like, I can use them for sure, but they're like pretty strong and they take a while to cool down. And then you start to get back into familiar territory uh, with a lot of these cool kids. One million, zillion, jillion, dillion, cotillion times later. Uh, 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 well, hello everyone. My name is the Jurassic Insider and welcome <laughs> back to the same episode of Jurassic World, the game uh, that you've been watching. Uh, it's, uh, it's actually been a while since I've recorded that first segment. In fact, I think this is the longest I've taken uh, between recording one segment of an episode and then finish or stopping it for some reason or another using an interruption or I just like don't feel like finishing it. So I just come back and make like a little bit of a seamless transition or sometimes I make it known, whatever it is. Uh, but this is the longest I've ever taken uh, because I think I made this first recording on August 26th. I checked back on it today. And then I went back and I saw, I went back and I was like, okay, I need to finish this video, right? Because I, I did something pretty cool in it. Uh, likely I hatched the Gorgasuchus that you just saw, which was pretty cool. Um, and I wanted to make it in a video because it's, it's pretty awesome because we don't get tournament hybrids every day of the week, obviously. So it's pretty awesome that we got to hatch that creature. Um, but right now it's like September 10th, September 9th, something crazy like that. It's been like two weeks basically since I've, I've continued this segment which is kind of wild yeah it, it took me a while if you're wondering why I uh I couldn't tell you actually I've recorded three episodes in between them so it's not like I've been like completely gone in two weeks like three episodes in two weeks it's not my best um but I was still getting videos I just didn't post them because I was just waiting for this one and for some reason I just kept forgetting I had this video and before I was about to post like each continuous video I was like I want to post this one first because I ha already had the Gorgasuchus you know what would be a point of uh, me uploading a video where I already had the Gorgasuchus? Uh, <laughs> if I didn't actually, and then I posted later the video where I got it. So I actually haven't played the game in like a hot second. There's been a lot of things that's probably happened. But I, I, I have recorded, so it shouldn't be like, it's not going to be like one of those videos where like, I'm catching up entirely. It's just going to be one of those videos where like, uh, well, I'm acting like, it, again, it's the startup of recording. But this video won't take long, I just need to like, conclude it properly. Uh, which is probably what I'm gonna do. So actually, you know what? Let's end it here. Let, let's end it here. Sorry for this insane recording. Uh, two weeks to end a video, and I'm ending it in like a two-minute clip. But honestly, this video was pretty much wrecked from the start. I just want to do it just because, again, we did something cool in it. So sorry, very unprofessional of me. This is like bringing me back to the era of like the 200s or the 100s of the episode numbers, uh, where we I just sort of did whatever. I came to my mind and I sort of just did things like choppily. So sorry for the disorganization. Hopefully we'll be back to normal. I think I do have some of these off episodes every now and then, and this is just one of them. But regardless, if you still somehow enjoyed, leave a like, please. That would be very cool. And subscribe. Or maybe don't subscribe just because I haven't really proved myself. And if you've never watched my video before, this one's probably really terrible. But hey, uh, the end cards should have something there. Or you should be recommended something. I actually don't have end cards because I can't. Because uh, of the format of these videos, uh, the, 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 the aspect ratio, that's what I mean. Uh, yeah, I need to fix that. I don't know how to fix that, but I'll figure it out. Uh, but regardless, yeah, you can go check out. Uh, it's probably I probably have an Up Next page now. Uh, it used to be that the Up Next videos didn't recommend my videos anymore. It recommended like, other people's videos. But there should be other things. If you can't find it in the description, there is a playlist of all my videos. And uh, also like a bunch of other Jurassic World game like playlists, like all the tournaments I've done, all of the like like special episodes I've done, like big occasions. So if you want to watch one of those, 
Um, there's plenty of episodes out there better than this one, uh, which is what I'm trying to get in. But regardless, we got through Gorgasuchus, so I guess we'll look at that for a quick second as we exit the video. But yeah, it looks awesome. It's super cool looking. It's got one of the OG models. It's pretty awesome. But anyways, I will see you all next time. This is Jurassic Insider signing out. <laughs>